एक्सपेक्टेड वैल्यू ऑफ अ फंक्शन ऑफ रैंडम वेरिएबल We will start with discrete random variable. X is discrete random variable, and it has n values: x1, x2, x3, up to xn. These are the n values of discrete random variable x, with probability probability that x is x1 is p x1. probability that x is x2 is p x2 and so on probability that x is xn is p x n these are the probabilities now suppose g x is a function of a random variable x then the expected value of this function g x for discrete random variable x is summation of g x i into p x i where i is changing from 1 to n because the random variable x has n number of values we can expand this summation this will be g x 1 into p x 1 plus g x 2 into p x 2 and so on up to gxn into pxn so by using this formula we can uh, find out the expected value of a function of a random variable where this random variable is discrete in nature now let's take an take an example of discrete random variable x is discrete random variable and uh, suppose it has six values 1 2 3 Four, five, and six, and these values are equally probable. So, probability that x random variable x is one is equal to probability that random variable x is two, and so on. Since all the values are equally probable, the probability of each value has to be. One by six because it has total six values. Sum of all probabilities has to be one. So now the function is say two x for all values of x. Now we have to find out the expected value of this function g x. So we will use this uh, formula. Expected value of g x is summation of g x i. Into p x i, where i is changing from one to six because the random variable x has six values. Now we can expand this summation. G x one into p x one plus g x two into p x two plus and so on. G x six into p x six. so these values are x1 x2 x3 and so on x1 is 1 x2 is 2 x3 is 3 and so on x6 is 6 so expected value of gx is gx1 so gx1 is 2x1 into px1 plus gx2 which is 2x2 into px2 and so on gx6 is 2x6 into px6 so 2 what is x1 x1 is 1 and px1 is 1 by 6 plus 2 x2 x2 is 2 and px2 is 1 by 6 And so on. Two x six is six, and p x six is one by six. So.
so expected value of gx is 2 by 6 2 by 6 is common in all the terms so we are left with 1 plus 2 plus uh, 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 so this uh, 2 by 6 is 1 by 3 and uh, this summation is uh, 3 plus 3 6 plus 4 10 16 plus 5 21 so the expected value of gx is 7 so that's how we find out the expected value of a function of random variable where the random variable is discrete in nature now let's see the continuous random variable A random variable is continuous in nature so suppose x is continuous random variable with PDF probability density function fx now gx is the function of function of random variable x so the expected value of gx since this uh, random variable is continuous in nature we will use integration integration of gx into fx where x is changing from minus infinity to plus infinity so to find the uh, expected value of function of uh, a random variable for continuous random variable we will use this integration formula let's take uh, one example in which x is x is continuous random variable and uh, x is uniformly distribu distributed uniformly distributed from uh, 0 to 2 we can draw the PDF of a random variable x f of x is pdf of random variable x and uh, this pdf is uniformly distributed from 0 to 2 area under the curve of pdf has to be 1 so height of pdf should be 1 by 2 now yes uh, gx is say 2x for all values of x now we have to find out the expected value of this function of random variable now x is continuous random variable so we will use this integration formula expected value of gx is integration of gx fx from minus infinity to plus infinity so for this example gx is 2x the pdf is uniformly distributed from 0 to 2 and uh, the value of pdf is 1 by 2 from 0 to 2 now we will integrate uh, inti uh, integrate to find uh, the expected value of this function gx so this is integration of x from 0 to 2 and integration of x is x square by 2 lower limit of, in of integration is 0 upper limit is 2 so 2 square by 2 minus 0 square by 2 so 2 square by 2 is 2 and 0 square by 2 is 0 so the expected value of uh, function of continuous random variable is 2 here so that's how we use uh, the uh, formula for discrete random variable and continuous random variable to find the expected value of a function of random variable.